Hey everybody, it's Char here, your health and wellness coordinator, and today is Wellness Wednesday. Today our focus is on our physical wellness. I wanted to focus a little bit about that shoulder and neck tension that you might be feeling. I know we're working a lot more from our desks during this pandemic, so I wanted to give you some tips and tricks on how to alleviate that neck and shoulder tension. The first thing you might want to try is changing your environment. Even if that means a different chair in your office or maybe a cushion on the floor, just to help sort of elevate you a little bit, just a little bit of a change environment even helps. The first thing you want to do is some deep breaths. When we breathe, we normally do shallow breathing. So I really want you to focus on deep breathing right to the lowest lobes of your lungs. So if you place your hands on your rib cage, the bottom part of your rib cage, you really want to feel that rib cage expand as you breathe in. So, you know, five or six deep breaths in, thinking of length through that shoulders, deep breaths. Number two is just to think about elongating through the back of the neck. So what you want to do is think of creating a cute little double chin. So dropping that chin down. But as you drop the chin down, think of lengthening through the back of the neck. Someone's pulling you up from the top of your head. Don't forcefully jam your chin into your chest, but just lengthen out. Drop those shoulders and lengthen. The next thing you wanna do is a little bit of thoracic mobility. So bring your hands out in front, drop those shoulders all the time. This is not good, so drop your shoulders. Open your arm up to the back. Try and keep your chest nice and square to the wall in front of you. So you can do some without looking at your hand. And then you can do a few repetitions following that hand as you open up. Okay, so a little bit of thoracic mobility. You could do elevator scapular stretch. So take one hand behind your neck. Yeah, push that hand down the center of your back. This opposite hand, push down and take a look. So just lengthening through that levator scapula. Switch to the other side, push your hand down. Think lengthen, lengthen, lengthen. Awesome. Then the other one you can do is some upper back mobility. So I always think it's like diving into the water. So you're going to dive forward with those hands. I round off a little bit through my upper back, lift my arms up, make sure I drop my shoulders, and then come to that W shape. Dive into the water, lift your hands up, pull your arms down. Dive, lift, drop the shoulders, and bring the arms down. So a few little tips and tricks, you can do that periodically throughout the day, and I really hope that helps to alleviate some of that shoulder and neck tension. Okay, have a great Wednesday.